Hello everyone, this is Dr. Eugene Sanders, Chief Executive Officer and Superintendent for Sandusky City Schools. Uh, we're here today with our monthly update for our Building Better Dreams facility plan, and I'm proud to be here at Venice Heights Elementary School with Mrs. Donna Taylor. Uh, Mrs. Taylor will be our new principal uh, at our new intermediate school, which is located right next to Sandusky High School. So Mrs. Taylor, thanks for being here today. Uh, I know the community knows you very well, but give us a little bit of your background and talk a little bit about how you're looking forward to your new assignment. Okay. I have been in Port Sandusky City Schools for the past 21 years. Um, I'm a proud 1992 graduate of Sandusky High School. I started out as a paraprofessional. Then I taught seventh grade. I also taught night school at the high school. And I am currently in my 16th year here as principal of Venice Heights Elementary. Well, Mrs. Taylor does a tremendous job here at Venice Heights, and starting uh, next year, uh, you're going to have perhaps the largest, one of the largest schools in our entire district being the principal of the new intermediate school. Uh, we're excited about it. Um, you've had an opportunity to kind of walk through the building a couple of times, most recently, maybe a week ago with staff. What were your first impressions of the building? And tell us a little bit about how excited you are to be uh, at the, new, the principal of the new intermediate school. Um, the building is huge. Um, it is probably one of the largest buildings that I have been in since my educational career. I'm looking forward to a unified approach to education. Our teachers will have an opportunity to collaborate for instructional planning. Our students will have access to 21st century technology that will definitely help them in their future. Looking forward to our community being able to walk through the building and everything that our new school has to offer. Well, we appreciate the support of our community uh, in terms of the vote a couple of years ago, going to uh, issue 12 that provided the local funds to build $70 million worth of new schools and your school, the intermediate school, would be uh, obviously the largest of the three uh, and a prime location right there on Hayes Avenue. One of the things that Mrs. Taylor mentioned uh, we're very excited about is our Global Education Center. Uh, which will have the, the best technology, 21st century technology that we'll use for global communications uh, for our students in the daytime and for uh, adult residents, hopefully through online uh, undergraduate, uh, graduate, and even high school uh, diploma related programs. Um, one of the things that you will have is two assistant principals, which will be new for you because you've been a single principal yourself for many years. Um, talk a little bit about what that looks like, and uh, obviously we'll have those persons on board by August of 2020. Um, I'm looking forward to being able to have other leaders in the building to help with instructional planning on the principal's end, to be able to provide the teachers additional support and help with the students making sure that our building is safe warm and inviting for all of our students. Well, you're going to have a big school. It's about probably between 950 and probably because you're there, more students are likely to come. And we're probably going to have uh, close to a thousand students in that facility. So two assistant principals, uh, appropriate number of secretaries, support staff, teachers uh, will be a part of it. And it's an exciting uh, time for Sanusky City Schools. Um, any uh, other plans that you have, uh, Mr. Sutter, you can share with us in terms of planning leading up to the new school or anything else you'd like for uh, anyone else to know about your new assignment? Um, I'm looking forward to having an opportunity to meet all of the three six students that will be joining us in fall of 2020. Looking forward to meeting the families and just welcoming the new experience kind of bittersweet because Venice will be turning 50 years old 2020 so we will be celebrating the 50 golden years of Venice Heights Elementary we'll be inviting former teachers administrators families and students of those who attended Venice Heights Elementary and saying our farewell, farewell goodbyes well, obviously, Venice has had a tremendous run, and you're uh, being probably one of the longest-serving principals at, at Venice. Um, we are proud to say that the building is not going away because our adult ed program uh, will be located here starting in the fall of 2020. Um, and we're looking forward to uh, uh, talking about in other monthly updates the kind of programming that we'll be doing here at Venice Heights and other places throughout the district. 
So again, if you want to stay updated with our new facilities uh, activities, please go to our website, www.scs-k12.net. Uh, you can email me directly at askdrsanders at scs-k12.net or call me directly at area code uh, 419-984-1000. This has been your monthly update on our Building Better Dreams facility uh, initiative. Thank you for being a part of Sandusky City Schools. And as we always say, go, go streaks. streaks.